All right, hi everyone, my name is Marilyn Vasanta. Uh, I work for VMware and I run all the product management for our edge computing platform. So um, if you asked me, I've been in this role now, I think it's like 14, 16 months. If you asked me before that, what did I know about the edge? I would have told you exactly zero. <laughs> so for me, um, this has just been a, com and, and you know what's interesting now, 16 months later, I am so excited and I, I love being focused in this area. It's just it's all the innovation that's happening, all the interesting customer challenges that we can solve. And it's interesting because um, you talk to some people and they're like edge, I'll call them edge deniers. They're people who are like, oh, you've done edge. We've already done edge. And I'm like, no, 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 but we're doing it in a new and fun, creative way. And so it's an interesting uh, conversation to convince people of the different use cases. So onto that is what we see is like what everyone was saying, you know, we know that edge is the future. Essentially, in the 2000s, we had kind of the revolution of VMware and the virtualization, and we were really kind of augmenting and improving that IT experience. And then the 2010s really brought us to the public cloud, and everything went to cloud, and we we're really augmenting that web experience and making that new and exciting and easy to consume. And what, how we see about edge now is I think it's about augmenting the human experience, and so it's all about the use cases that are making edge a reality because taking compute to the edge, taking Kubernetes to the edge, while exciting from a technology perspective, what's really the driver, what's really the business value, and what's really the new and exciting things that we're providing for our customers to really have workloads at the edge that then is driving the need for us to do, you know, shrinking the stack, optimizing Kubernetes, doing great open source so uh, software to be able to enable these new use cases at the edge. So I wanted to focus in on one vertical and tell a few customer stories. So I wanted to talk a little bit about manufacturing. So this is an area where it's, it's interesting because again, when I go speak to customers, everyone's like on a different part of the journey. Everyone knows they need, they need Kubernetes at the edge. They know they need to modernize their apps. They know they need to do new edge native applications because you can't just take your app that you wrote from the public cloud and take it over to the edge. You've got to think of all the different constraints from network to the runtime to the different devices to what you're trying to accomplish. And so for manufacturing, it's interesting because I wanted to say something. I don't think it's controversial, but I think it's how I see at the edge, while everyone's in the different journey of modernizing, I don't think VMs are going away. Um, I'm of the opinion that we're going to have to have them kind of coexist. But what's interesting about manufacturing is that because the manufacturing industry is still a very physical world, we can actually just jump them right directly to Kubernetes and their modern apps. So it's one of these things of, but then how do we do that? A lot of that is, needs to be focused around how we're enabling the different ecosystem, the partner ecosystem. Because one of the first roles I had at VMware was um, solution engineering. And I, I think back that this new role with Edge is very reminiscent to like my first uh, role at VMware 10 years ago, which was around BDI. And just like the Edge, how do you make a platform real? It's all about bringing together the vertical solutions. And that's the really exciting part about manufacturing. So what I was trying to say is in manufacturing, what's happening right now is that for every new use case, typically a whole new set of hardware gets deploy deployed in the factory. And so it's, it's, you've got a lot of hardware sprawl. You have all these applications that don't know how to speak to each other. So how are you going to enable new real-time decision making or um, all that feedback loop um, to have these applications kind of talk together. And like I said, some of these vendors have completely moved to Kubernetes. Some of them are still on bare metal, and some of them are the legacy companies that have had, you know, they've created that manufacturing software 20 years ago. The developer is long gone, and no one knows how it works, and so they just know it runs in that VM, and so you restart it kind of forever. So it's, manufacturing is an interesting place where so many things are coming together. And I'm not even talking about all the different IoT use cases, all the small form fact hardware that our previous speaker was just talking about. So all of, how do we enable all of this together? And so, um, so that kind of really brings the, the next part of the story that I want to talk about. Okay. So. I kind of want to wrap up in terms of, I just kind of talked about how we're enabling for manufacturing the different part of the ecosystem. So the, the overall business driver, like I was saying, is all about bringing those different apps together. So we know we have the different challenges to solve at the edge. Um, we're solving runtime with all the modern bits with Kubernetes. Connectivity, we're also solving with optimizing the platform and putting the hardware closer. With app management, um, you can hear our various speakers talk about TAP and our different um, types of programs. But what I want to close upon is, 
like I was just showing with the big picture of manufacturing, if you have all these discrete systems and we're all trying to enable new business value with new immersive real-time experiences, how are we gonna bring that together at the edge? And then this leads me to the talk that I will give a little bit later with Ed um, about data management. So that's the kind of last bit of my talk is, for me, the ability to do a full solution at the edge, bring along our partner ecosystem, so we can help our customers really full, realize their value and how do we bring all of their data together across all of the systems in one common platform at the edge. Thank you.